presented by The Deli, located in the Jones and Guerrero building in Hagadia. Open 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. Monday through Saturday. Holiday and welcome back. It was one year ago when I had the opportunity to sit down and talk with costume designer and island girl Rita McGee. While well, she's back for some R&R &R and we check in to see what she's been up to. Here's more. Go swimming, eat, gifts. But she's I'm back. Costume designer Rita McGee is currently on island recharging her batteries and getting in some much needed time with her family and friends before the new year. Now if you recall we first featured Rita back in January of last year when she landed work on the TV show Empire. When I left I got nominated for an Emmy and then I also got nominated for a Costume Designers Guild Award which was great because that's my peers. Once the first season of Empire concluded, Rita moved on to a slew of projects and experiences. I worked on Chirac, a Spike Lee movie, with my mentor Ruth Carter and my sister Alita McGee Bailey. We worked together on that film, which was great. And we did that in the summertime. And then I worked on Zoe Ever After with Brandy, which was fantastic. Working with her was great. And she also, Brandy also did Chicago the Musical. And we saw her perform that. Me and my sister went to see her and she's just phenomenal. So I've been so blessed and fortunate with after that job, it opened the door to so many other jobs. For example, a horror movie. It opened up the doors to so many different things and it's just, you know, getting different training and learning from everything and putting different things in my toolbox. One of those projects included the much anticipated BET miniseries highlighting the boy band, New Edition. New Edition. It's the story of New Edition, how they started. It takes us from when they started, it takes us to 1997. And the story is ongoing, which is great because they're living, breathing, talented, still performing, still doing tours. And it's, it's wonderful. It was a great experience because we, the wardrobe team, me and Alita, we met with New Edition. They gave us their notes. They said how they wore their clothes, what colors they liked. She was grateful to be part of the project because for her, it's a game changer. It's really phenomenal. And the music is still current today. It's music, it's a history of our lives. You know, it's a soundtrack of that stuff we still listen to. Upon arriving on island for vacation, Rita has been just as busy. I've been more busy on Guam than I've been in <laughs> LA. Just, you know, in LA I'm, I, I work, which is great. And my family's there too. So I go to work, I go to the mall, I go home, I go to work. It's like this. And then in Guam, it's a boop, 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 which is which is really great. I was like, you know what? I can't complain to say I'm sitting doing nothing because I'm really busy. You know, seeing my sister's friends, my family friends. So it's really good. A couple of those engagements included speaking to fifth grade students during career day at Lee Guan Elementary School and meeting with the fine folks of the Guam International Film Festival. My friend Lou Dunka is a counselor there and she was like, if you could come and talk to the fifth graders about careers because this is when they start to develop it and think about it at this time now so the fifth grade class came in it's on my instagram and they were so great she leaves a day after christmas and heads back to la where she will start up on another project project i'm not going to tell you until i come back again but i do just follow me on instagram and all that stuff like that but i do i have another project coming up in the new year but in our business which is still a good thing we like to wait till we're doing it you know you know the you know sign the paper and then say okay but i do i have some good projects coming up in the new year rita attributes much of her success to the experience she earned while on island something she encourages to those aspiring to get into the business being away and looking at the Instagram of the Guam Film Festival and Don and Kel, that they're, you're doing it here. Do it all right here, bloom where you're planted. Do it right here. And then when you branch off to other places, if you go to the States, wherever it is in the States, you have your work experience because you're already doing it here. So it will be a better transition and an easier transition when you go and work in the States or wherever it is that you have experience under your belt. Now to keep up to date with her latest projects, make sure to follow her on Instagram at Rita McGee Official. Stick around, we have KUM Connections when In the Mix returns. <laughs>